Many of you will notice from taking it when things go bad class that we burn a burn barrel outside our firefighter survival and our rapid intervention skill stations. There's an extreme significance to this. Knowing that we transition from our forebrain to our midbrain when we feel that death is imminent or another brother or sister is in a building about to die that we're going to rescue, we transition from our forebrain to our midbrain. We understand that with that transition, sensory gating occurs, which are of our five senses, we will diminish some senses and enhance others that we feel is more important. With the five senses, there's one sense that does not sensory gate, and that's our sense of smell. It's because the olfactory nerve is wired straight to our amygdala and does not go through our prefrontal cortex. Gaining a realistic smell while completing a successful evolution will give us an overwhelming calming sensation when it's the time to really do it. For instance, if you get trained really, really good on firefighter survival skills or rapid intervention skills, and then step out of the engine or truck on a fire and you're gonna have to perform one of these skills, all of a sudden you'll smell that fire and you'll be all of a sudden cognitive anxiety will start taking over and you'll conceptualize positive and negative thoughts and you'll say, you know, I'm good at those skills but I've never done it on a real fire. So we can start getting this cognitive anxiety can increase. However, by tricking your midbrain into a realistic smell during training, now we'll step out and our midbrain will just have a calming sensation and that ego will build saying, I've completed the successful evolution at a real fire. Our midbrain is not that smart and tricking your midbrain is key.